Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host Zelot, and we're here today doing the Alpha 9 series. So we're out in the space base here. Um, we're gonna... Oh, there's an artifact left from me looking to see if it was gonna fit. Yeah, visual artifact. Lovely. But first of all, what I want to do is I want to try and oxygenate the bay because... It won't oxygenate currently. Um, so I think we just need more oxygen. <laughs> so let's do that. I'm going to put um, that like this. So we're going to put, I think we're going to go for another 16. Come on. There we go. So we'll do two stacks of eight tanks again, and we'll put that up to the ceiling. Okay, yeah, so we'll, so that'll go like that. Okay. Oops, there we are. Get these in, come on. Oh, I put in the wrong. I put in the wrong block facing. We're gonna pop those out. That was a derp. Considering how tough these freaking things are to <laughs> remove. go on the outside of the block, not the inside. Okay. Now let's just finish putting in the uh, O2 on this one. That way we don't screw it up. Okay, and two more. We should have enough O2 made to fill this up too. We'll take a look at that in a second here. Let's just get this stuff in. Okay. And we're going to put those to the ceiling like there. Maybe not on these ones. Yeah, let's not. Or should I? I think it'll look weird if I don't. Because I was probably going to put more capacitors on these. If I can put those right to the ceiling too. You know what? Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's just... We'll just do it. Which one is that? That is... Uh, that's those ones. Come on. Come on. There we go. Yeah, come on, pull it across. There we go. And across. And last one. That there. Okay. So that's eight more. I think we should do. Well, we've got four more we can put here. So let's get this down. I think that's the closest I can do that. Yeah. So we'll just go like that. Like that. Okay. And then. Okay, I think we've got four more made. Oops. Let's take a look. Yep. It's weird. Put it in. Didn't stack them when it made them. Oh, I must have been in it or something looking at it. 
Yeah, I don't think it stacks correctly when you're looking in, when you have the container open. Okay, so that's another 16. We basically just doubled the amount, the capacity, so we're going to have to fill those up now. Okay, let's get this in. finished off so I stopped shy of putting a whole bunch of container controllers with a bunch of extensions on the base because if I do that I'll have to put in some more some like generators and fuel and it's always going to be consuming fuel a little bit so I'm not sure if I want to do that. Um, I think what I want to do is... Ah, oh, stupid. Okay, that's going to bug me. Let's just... Um, <laughs> oh, stop it. Let's see, if, uh, let's see if we can fill this up now. And, all right, we can go in this way. So we should be able to go into the oxygen... So 72,000, 36 tanks. <laughs> okay, and then I think I put it in the dump. Yeah, I've got a bunch of them going in here. Let's see what it's going to take. Holy crap, holy. There we go, there we go. And can we... <sighs> the moment of truth. Can we turn... The oxygen on, let's see. Um, devices. We've got ventilators. Did that. Did it work? Did it work? What have we got in the base? Oh, wow. It definitely took a bunch of oxygen. I think it worked. I think we got it. I think we hit that magic number where we have oxygen in this space now. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> okay, that artifact's bugging me. Um, but what we'll do is we're going to spawn in the dart. You can see that I've got I was testing out to see if it was going to fit in here, and it's no problem. This place is awesome. I haven't finished painting and putting up all, finishing all the railings, but uh, so what I was going to do, the artifacting thing is driving me nuts, but hopefully they fix that on the next patch. Um, so this is kind of what I was going for here, and I realized that these are really expensive to power up. Like when you consider each one of these cubes, cost 10 power units to maintain constantly is consuming 10 power units each one of these so you know i mean that's that's pretty substantial that's that's 20 right there that's 200 power units this one thing is i'm like holy crap i can't fill this place up i was about to I was about to, and then I'm like, there's got to be a better way of doing this so that I don't, like, do something stupid. I think I figured out how we're going to do it. I think we're going to figure, I think I figured out how we're going to do it. We're going to test it with the CV that I bring in. So let's do that right now. I know we've got some artifacting right here, but I'll, uh, once we spawn it in, I'll, 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 uh, I'll log out and log back in to get rid of the artifact. Okay, so <laughs> it's crazy. Eh? It's, it's crazy, crazy game bugs. Okay, so this thing is the dart. Let's, ooh, it'll spawn there and squish our thing. Let's see if we can get it to go up a little higher, down a little lower, over a little bit. There we go. Looks good to me. There we go, the dart. So I'm going to just quickly do a soft log. 
I don't I don't have a slouch for a machine. Don't worry. I don't. I'm not going to speed this up. Or this should just take a second. And there we go. Okay. So there we go. The and what the hell is that? Oh, come on. Really? Oh, I'm going to have to restart the game to get rid of that. Okay. I don't really care right now. I'm just going to show you around. Uh, there's no weapons on this yet. This is my... What I consider my combat CV in the way of... Um, being able to take on space... POIs. Now, it might not look like much. It really doesn't look like anything at all, really. It's it's just it's just an innoxious lump of metal with kind of that ends up in a pointy end. I call it my dart. This thing is all armor and thrusters. <laughs> that's, that's all it is. But we're going to have to make it Alpha 9. So we're going to have to do something with the cargo. We're going to have to do something with its ammo boxes. So that's what we're going to do today is we're going to retrofit this thing. Um, I do have a bunch of cargo containers and a bunch of extensions ready to go. So we're going to, we're going to start off by popping all these out. So let's do that. First of all, uh, let's connect to... What do we got here? Why does it show us half? No, that's no, we're not connected to that. Uh, we're blocks and we've got lots left 50, 55,000 SU. Come on. It just, there we go. Thank you. Yeah. 55,000. So we should be able to carry quite a bit. Let's do this. Get back to my other toolbar and we're just going to grab these. I'm not going to salvage them. I, I'm actually going to reuse them because they are still useful. Actually, they're quite useful because uh, and I'm going to have to get rid of that. These aren't going to be big enough. Those aren't going to and they're they're not they're just not suitable for um, modern Alpha 9 weight limits. So let's get rid of these. Okay, do I got any more in here? Do I have any more? Combat steel. Now, I should get rid of all this combat steel ribbing here. And how's that on the side? That That's a little thin. I don't want to get rid of that. Now there is, obviously if it takes a blow to the side, it could be an issue because it is a little thin. It's only one block thick right there. That's its thinnest point. Um, but other than that, I mean, there's no weapons or anything there. So it's if you're getting hit there, it's because you're avoiding another hit and took one on the took one on the hip, which is fine. Should be able to take one or two hits before losing a combat steel block um, now keep that keep in mind the artillery cannon fire is much more dangerous now it does way more damage than it used to so let's let's actually pick these up because I think I'm gonna need to use this space here for cargo extension so I'm going to dig into these areas here, a bit of the bulkhead, but these are unnecessary bulkhead areas, and I think I just want to remove them. So that's thruster, thruster. It's funny how I'm beside the thruster, it's heavy radiation, but I've never actually, and is that the, the warp? Yeah, the warp is like insane rad radiation, but it has no fuel in it. It's never been used before. It's kind of a funky thing <laughs> with the game. Okay, um, now I could I could pump pop these out, but I don't think I need to because we can come around here. 
See, we can put a bunch of extensions up into here. Because this is all airspace. Bulkhead airspace. Um, yeah, this thing can take one hell of a beating in the front of it. Before it gets into the cockpit, let me tell you. Uh, and I think we're okay on the cockpit itself. Uh, let's take a look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, maybe not. Can we not get up over there, through there? Maybe not. Okay, we've got to get up around the other way. We should probably be doing this with the... Um, with the drone instead of... Instead of us doing this personally. Okay, it's down. There's a way to get in and out. It's like right down here, isn't it? Yeah, okay. So we can't cover that area yet. Okay. So. I'm thinking. Is this combat steel? Armor locker. That's an armor locker. Right. Okay, so that's all open now. So this is going to be all blocks. Is that blocks there? No. Okay, should we... You know what? I think I need to pop this. Because the ammo... This thing is going to need actually a fairly substantially large... A couple of large ammo boxes. Yeah, so I think what we're going to do, do I have any carbon, let's, do we have any carbon, big carbon blocks made? I know that sounds cheesy, but, but on the inside of, of a vessel now, I think that's the way to go for, for weight. Because who cares? It's the inside. If, if you're... If your interior walls are getting blown up, well, it's probably way too late by then. <laughs> way, way too late. Um, and besides, it's just a separator wall. wall. It's not the hall. It's just, a, it's just a room separator. So I think what I want to do is I want to make... Did I see any in here? We have the small ones. Why are these all separate? Can't, won't they stack? Yeah, that's weird. I don't know why things don't necessarily auto stack when you throw them in there, but whatever. Okay, let's grab those. Uh, and we're also gonna need the cargo boxes again. Now, I could put these down, but the, you can see they're, they're, they're pretty much useless. 250 storage units is completely and utterly useless as a device nowadays that is now deco I would consider or I what I'll do actually you know what I'll do yeah I know no not water that's the type of thing that's good for salvage because <laughs> that's all it's good for Okay, um, yeah, let's make some. Let's make some. I don't see any in here, so let's make some. And I think that's all we're going to need. We're also going to need weaponry and ammo. So we want to think about that too. So let's make that. Um, I've, I've unlocked pretty much everything now. What level am I again? I am level 23. So we've pretty much unlocked everything we can for the CV in the way of what we want. Um, so we've, we've got all the weapons up to, we can't do 25 yet, obviously. I got the controller that we're gonna need. I got the repair bay stuff. I got the tool turrets, because I wanna make a tool turret for this thing. So I think, we want to go with the how many of these can we put on we can do we can do four of these so so we're going to want to make four rocket launchers and then the rocket turrets now include the uh 
do they include the flak? They include something else, and I was a little bit surprised by it. I think they, they might include, I think the flak are included in there. But we're definitely going to make four of these, and four of these. So we'll start producing those right now. Okay, so let's go into one of our advanced constructors that we have waiting patiently for us, which we have, I want to show you. I forgot to show you. Um, so we put the furnace in, smelted down everything. I've got, where's the ingots one? Yeah, so this is what we have extra just sitting in in the uh, ingots um, controller. And yeah, so we're, we're going to be fine. We should be able to make whatever we want, I think. I think for mats wise, the only thing that we're really short on is sathium. And uh, currently we are sitting at 503 sathium that's left over after, after smelting down everything that we mined up. We ended up finding a bunch of uh, mines on that desert planet and they were just, uh, it was a kind of an annoying planet. I'm not sure if I even want to go back there to do the questing. I think I want to go check out the temperate planet close to us and try questing there. Uh, anyway, so this is going to be our limiting factor right now. I'm not sure if I can get, if I can put these into the deconstructor to get Sathium out of them, we might be able to. Uh, that'll be our last resort if we need to. But in the meantime, we're going to start making. We do have some stuff already made that it can leverage right off the bat, that the weapons can leverage. But things like power coils and stuff will eat up the sathium. So let's get to making that. Okay. So we're connected to that. We're going to put our weapons in here. We need. Uh, so in there, rocket launcher for CVs. These are going to be freaking expensive, but I really want these. I really, really want these as my main shoot trigger, shoot with the trigger weapon. Because you can't do very many like that. You can, you only have very few cannons for it. Uh, there's a level 25 one too, but I don't want to wait till then I want the rocket launchers so let's do four of these and yeah that's going to eat up a flux coil and what do flux coils take to make two sathium okay so we're we can definitely get all the we definitely have the mats to make these rocket launchers. Not an issue. Now, the other ones that I want to do is the rocket turrets. Rocket turret CV. Here we go. Uh, flex coil. Three of the power coils. So that's five flex coils per. Um... That means it's 10, 10 sathium per turret. That's not that bad. That's not that bad. So let's make, um, let's make four of these. I know I want four right off the bat for sure. And then we also want cannon turrets, which are the projectile turret CV. Yeah, there we go. And capacitor device, oscillators, five oscillators, and three capacitor device. Oscillator. So that's eight oscillators. So that's 16 sathium per. Okay, so, okay, we should be fine. We should be fine. So let's get, uh, 
six of those made. So we want six of the projectile CV turrets. One, two, three, four, five, six. That'll give us 10 turrets on it. Now I'm not sure if I want to do any of the artillery turrets. And I'm not level 25 yet anyway, but I'm not sure if I will be. We'll see. Apparently flak turrets rock for bases, but I'm not sure how they are for CVs. Anyway, I think we'll we'll leave it here. Uh, I do have uh, some sentry guns made. So this one's cranking out some weapons. The other one we need some... Let's put it into blocks. Okay, so we are going to need some controllers. We need the... Uh, I wish they had painted these so that we could see them. Orn wood CV. So we need, I'm not sure if I'm going to need two of these. Probably only going to need one massive one. We could do, we could do a massive. Um, you know what, I'll make two of these. I'll make two of these. And then I need the ammo ones. Container controller. Container controller ammo for base, CV. Okay, so I'm gonna make two of these too. And we've already got regular cargo. Okay, I think we should be good with the interior stuff now, so uh, let's let's go ahead and grab that. So we're connected. Yeah, we're not going to need. I, I don't know if I'm going to do a big container controller because I, I I'm just going to do the ore and wood one. I think for now. Let's just put this back. Well, that's the ammo. Um, and that's the ore and wood. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so let's put these in. These go on the inside. Uh, oh, and I was gonna, I was gonna do do the plastic blocks for separators. So let's get those made. Let's get the plastic blocks for separators, the big ones. Carbon composite. Probably only gonna need. Let's make twenty. If that, I probably don't even need that. That's okay. They're they're cheap. They're cheap. They're cheap. Okay, so let's grab those. Okay. <clears throat> so what we could do is we could do. wondering how we should do it could and should how could and should we do this do I want it balanced that's the thing how balanced do I need it this is a CV we're gonna be out in space mostly with this thing this thing is not gonna necessarily be the uh, this is this is just going to drop off a miner, if anything, at this point, and blow up stuff out in space. So, balance-wise, I don't think we have to worry about balance. I don't think we're going to really have to worry that much about balance. And if I'm wrong, then then great. I don't mind being wrong. Uh, in the meantime, I guess we're going to need to separate. 
we're going to need a, a physical separator. So let's separate there. And then I'm guessing we could just put like an ammo there, fill this wall up. Another ammo there, fill this wall up. And then I guess we could still go with the cargo boxes along the sides because I still will want the the 64 unit spaces that they provide. Um, so these are... What? These are SVHV ones now. So when I popped them out, they became SVHV ones. <sighs> okay, so these are uh, less than useful to us. So we got to make some more of them. We got to make regular ones. So, okay. Okay, I didn't know that they were going to convert to um, useless ones. <laughs> wow. Okay, well, if that's the case, then I'm just going to get rid of them too. Although, eh, whatever, whatever. We'll hold on to them for now. We have some regular ones here. Let's grab those. There we go. There we go. Okay. Okay, so we want ammo. What is that? Is that the ammo? Yes. They need to freaking color code these. That's just... Okay, so I think we're going to go ammo like this, and then controller, 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 and controller into there. Okay, so what does that give us? 56,000. Okay, we're going to have to go with that. Hopefully it's enough. I know the um, some of the ammo gets a little heavy for this thing. Okay, so let's put another one here right beside it and we'll just uh, we'll just do exactly the same thing. We'll do controller. Oh, 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 crap. No, 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 no. That I went too much there, didn't I? Went, oh no, that's right. Is that right? God, it doesn't look like... That. Yeah, that lines up. Okay. I'm just... I don't know why it just looked all skewed. Anyway. Okay. Okay, so there's our two ammo boxes. Um, that should be sufficient for ammo for this thing. God, I hope so. I hope so. I mean... Really? And then what we're going to do is we're going to do regular cargo here. So we're going to do the 16K cargo boxes. These are the newer looking ones. Let's do that. Let's retrofit these in. So now we'll have proper ones in here, not the 250 SU ones, which they were before. Okay, so there's, there's proper, modern, sophisticated cargo boxes. Okay, now... I haven't filled this thing up yet. That's okay. So now we need to put the, the ore... So how are we going to do this? Can't go there, can't go there. Didn't realize there was a... So we could do... Will that go up? Will that touch anything up there? It will if I pop that out. If I pop that one out. If I pop that one out. So we could do... Okay, so this is going to be... No, I could put other gear there. That's what I could do. I could put it, or another cargo box. I could put more gear there. We can move some of the gear up there. Let's 
It's not that bad of an idea, really. Um, hmm. We can't duplicate that on this side, though, can we? But 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 what we can do is we can get up into here, and we can wrap around that side. So if we put See, there's lots of space there. Yeah. I'm unfriendly with... I'm unfriendly with them. No. But they used to hate me before. What changed? Um... Hmm. Hmm. Is that usable space right there? Or is that a container? I think that's usable space right there. I could put extensions. So, yeah, I think we, we need to just fill up this freaking thing with extensions at this point, right? So let's do that. Let's do that. So I'm just going to start putting extensions in where they'll fit. Now I really want to put I really want to put the ammo there. So uh, let's do this. I want uh, I want the panel facing down like that. Do we want it like that? Yeah, I'm probably gonna move. I'm gonna pop. Oh, good. It's brown when you put it in. See that? Oh, and those ones turned, they, they were naturally green when you put them in. Okay, well, at least they color code, them, color code themselves when they when they get placed. Okay. Um, so these right here will just continue. So, can I get up in there? Can I get up in there? Like, is this going to actually do anything if I... Do I need to pop that one? Do I need to pop that one? Or we can make this one a smaller one. Hang on, let's see how big it is. Let's see how big it is. It's not very big, is it? Fifty six thousand units. That's not very big. It's not a bad it's not bad for an overflow. Thing is it's right up the center. It's really balanced, I think. <laughs> like I could still get away with kind of keeping this thing balanced, believe it or not. Hang on, I'm I'm all out of whack here. Let's straighten out. Okay. Um, yeah, like I can still, I can put the other one in, see I can do that, I can do Pop those out. So, but that, how are we going to connect that? I need, I need to pop that out. I need to pop that out. I got to pop this one out here. Ah, oh, crap. I didn't want to pop the whole thruster out. Damn. Is that the only way we can get up there? There's got to be another way up there this right here there we go there we go so now we can go like this go like this and like this okay so now we can put the thruster back in right Yeah, we can put the thruster back in and we'll be able to put 
blocks here. Okay. Okay, so let's grab that thruster. And what frickin' way were you facing? Oh God, who, who knows? Who really knows? I'm gonna have to go outside and see which way it's going. Okay, so we need it facing that way. Okay. Had it there for a second. Come on, no, right, get, come, there. Okay. Okay. Uh, so good. Now we have our connector piece. We can, we can just go like this now. We can go like this, and then like this, and then like that, and like, come on, like that. And like that, and then our connector here, our our controller, I should say. Oh crap! Can we get up in there? I did I screw up? Can we still get up in there? I might have to pop out the. Uh, might have to pop this block out. It's not a bad idea actually. We can we can actually gain some some storage. We don't need a combat steel block right there. Don't need one there either. We can get away with oh, what do you mean no oxygen? Oh crap. <laughs> I'm gonna suffocate. <sighs> That's why I always have emergency O2 on you at all times. Okay. So, well, if I'm suffocating in here, maybe I should um, power this thing up. Okay. What do we got here? We've got the dart. Oh, we got to put a Wi-Fi on this too somewhere. Let's um, get the fuel in. Base. Fuel. Uh, here, let's throw everything in here. There we go. Oh, crap. How do I get out of here? Get it, get up. Get out of there. <laughs> yeah, I'm not supposed to be there. That's why the blocks were there. <laughs> Especially when this thing powers up. Okay, so... Uh, what do you mean? I'm not too hot anymore. Oh, I was. I went... Oh, I got really... I got really freaking hot is what it's saying. <laughs> I got really, really freaking hot is what it's saying. Okay, it's time to eat something. <laughs> We've got, um, uh, you know what? I'm just going to do an emergency O2. Or, uh, sorry, an emergency ration. Since I can just make them like nothing now. Okay. <laughs> uh, so now this thing's powered up. Okay, let's uh, let's deal with the oxygen in it. We can put oxygen in here. Uh, oxygen, and I think I had it in the dump container. Yep. Yeah. Ooh, I gotta make me some more oxygen. Holy crap! Filling up this base and the. Uh, <laughs> And the CV is, uh, yeah, okay, so while I'm working on it, I want this on. I want it on. Really? Okay, go like this then. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And then let's turn the thrusters off, though.
There we go. Light signals, turrets, that's all fine. Thrusters off. Oh, saw something. Turn the engines off. There we go. That'll turn the RCS off. And that gives us 88 hours of power idle. Okay, that's good. So, we've got the ammo. We've got this one cargo controller. Small one. And then we're going to try and get this this massive one in too so here we're gonna have to put some regular blocks in just to space it don't really want to but kind of have to yeah that's fine we'll just uh we'll do that we'll do that and then we want controller like that yeah that's fine okay so now now we have how much 64,000 already on this side so let's keep we're gonna extend it out and wrap it around the front I think and try and put some over to that side it should uh, oh, come on should be able to thank you Okay, so we'll just go out through here. So what I'm thinking is we can put another one there for that one. So let's do that. Come on. There you go. And then... And I could put, I could make it even bigger by putting some more here, but then it'll make it harder to balance. Uh, you know what? That's not too bad though there. We'll go put it there. We're not going to be able to get it to go by if we put it there though. So from here, we've got a put one of these and then like that and then come on stop it and then like that there we go okay so now that one's isolated the other one we got to bring up here now so that one is going to come up into this cavity here um so what we can do is we can run it along up through here and around. I think I want to try that. Or we can just run it across and fill this in. That's not bad either. Let's just do that. That way it keeps the, all the weight centralized. So we'll just uh, we'll slowly add to this so um not sure if i want to fill that in that was hollow there before but we'll yeah why not okay so what are we at what are we at what are we at let's let's oh wait do i want to yeah i might as well i don't have any weapons on this yet that's fine Okay, um, where are you? Right here. Cargo box. It's no, oh, these aren't cargo boxes. These are harvest. Yeah. Okay, that one's 72,000. And, oh. And that one's 96. So 72, 96 is the one we're working on. So 72 is not bad for a smaller one. So 96. Uh, and these are eight increments each one. So. Yeah, I think we only want to. I think we just want to go for right from the side here, don't we? 
So we'll just duplicate what the other one had going. We'll go like this. Keep going like this. And across because I mean, I guess we could uh, Well, we'll we'll see. We'll see. Let's uh let's fill this in. Get this filled in. That way uh that's going to be way more than that's 80. Yeah, I've already I'm going to max this one out pretty soon. So let's um Let's cover this now. We're going to seal this. Okay, what's it at? Hasn't connected it yet. Okay. So, this will be the connector point here. Let's and right there. That'll be connected now. Let's take a look. Uh, 232, so we're almost at max. I'll just fill this in here. And then, what are we at? 288. And what are we at? Almost one more. One more and it's maxed out. Okay. So we have a maxed out one. Um, actually, what I should do is just make another one right here. Pop that out. Um, yeah, let's. Let's actually pop this out. Oh, stupid thing, come on. Uh, was that the connector for there? That was the connectors. Okay, so it's going to lose a big chunk when I take those. It's going to lose a big chunk. Okay. Um, so we're going to pop this one and this one. And then both those get carbonate. Yep. Okay. So uh, that gets a carbonate block, and that gets a carbonate block, and then my controller. So that just shrank the other side. It's no longer maxed, but if I put a regular controller in here, or I could, well, I could just, I could just connect these. I could just connect these. That's not a bad idea too, and just make a second large, two large ones then. Should I do that? Should I just connect those then? 
and then have we'll have um, we'll have a second really large one too and then um, yeah yeah I think that's a good idea I think that's a good idea so let's just do that let's just put more blocks in then we'll just put more of the extenders in right because we've we've disconnected the other one from these if we go like this that one's by itself it's not connected to anything as soon as I put this one in and then this one in see it won't connect that means it's that's connecting to two different ones now. That's connecting to two different ones. Why is that? Why is that? Should only be connecting to one. Okay, so something's wrong here. Something's not. Something's not the way it's supposed to be. So this will go and connect to the other one, right? And then that's it. There's no other. So I don't get it. What would, okay. Is it this one? Ah, that's the one. There it is. Okay. Okay, so let's get that filled in. So that needs to be a block. Okay. There we go. So now, now we can, hey, I had you. Come on. Come on. Two. Thank you. Now I can go like this and like this and like this. And yeah this and like 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 this see that's all it was okay okay and then let's keep keep on track here so this one is the current one we're working on 200,000 this one oops this one just drop down to 232. Okay, they're getting pretty even, aren't they? That's pretty good. So, go like this, and this, and this, and this. And then I guess we'll just, whoops, jeez. A little disorientated there. Then we'll just uh guess finish putting some blocks in here for that one. Okay, what are we at here on both of them? 232 and 264. Not bad, really. I mean, uh, uh, that, that, okay. Two eighty. I think the other one was 232, 264, 264 and 280. <sighs> See, I'm thinking I can put one right there. I can pop this one out right here. And put a regular controller in. Okay, so let's do that. Because yeah. 
Because, yeah. <laughs> exactly it. Okay, so let's fill, let's put like this and like this. And then we're going to have some, geez, jumpiness from the mouse. Thank you. Thank you. Stop now. Thank you. This is fairly centered, not too badly. So we bring this up. I mean, sure, it's is it ahead of the cockpit? Yeah, but this will give us another. Really frickin' large storage. Okay, so... Pop it in there. So we want a regular controller. Regular controller. How am I gonna get out of here? I need to get up into here. Where... Why am I... Got no oxygen. Okay, it's it's not oxygenated into here. Why is that? That's blocking it now. That never used to. That never used to be airtight. Huh. Okay, we got to change that. We got to fix that. I. I don't ever remember these things being airtight. Come on. O2. Come on. Come on. Where are you, O2? Really? What's going on here with the O2? God, I've been I've been experiencing weird things with O2 lately where it's just like nope we'll be we'll oxygenate oxygenate everything except for these three blocks here <laughs> see it's ox see there's oxygen here what what there was for a sec did you see that look at like what <laughs> like, what so does that mean no, no oxygen. There's no oxygen in here. So do I need to put oxygen in? Obviously I do. So what the hell? Okay, well, in the meantime, let's put the container in. Let's put the container in. That's fine. Okay. Get this in. All right. Oh, I got to put regular regular cargo in first. Fill that up. Get it up to there. And now I can put this in. There. Now this should be pretty decent sized. 200,000. Yeah, that's that's pretty good. Okay. Okay. So there we go. We've got that. Oh, now we've got O2. Oh, was that all it was? Because there's something not sealed to the outside on that. Oh, okay. I bet you that's all it was. That's all it was. I didn't have this sealed in. That was it then. That was it. Just sealed. Just doing the sealing thing. Yeah. Yeah, that's what it was. So I removed that unnecessarily. <sighs> Although I should put it somewhere else. It's not going to go anywhere else, is it? I could plop this off. Put it there. You know, it was, it was fine where it was. It was fine where it was. It just... 
Okay, and which one was that? That was the one that does the non-poisonous bite one. Okay. So that's the little one, I think. So we want... Yeah, that one. Okay. And let's spin that. Like, there. And there we go. We still got air. Okay, we're, we're, we're good. We're good. Okay. <laughs> okay, so I think we have our cargo sorted. Let's take a look. No, oh, stop that. Oh, you know what? Uh, Wi-Fi right here. Yeah, and the, and the game engine is starting to give me some problems. So it's a good time to actually... We're just going to finish this off really quick. Uh, we're going to make a Wi-Fi and throw that in, and then we're going to call it an episode. We'll put the uh, weapons on next episode and we'll go take it out for a spin so uh let's get this made really quickly here oops so we'll get this made and put in uh yeah i don't have any wi-fi made so we're gonna make one and we'll grab that Okay, so, because they're airtight, I might as well just pop it into there, really. Yeah. This will just be fine, just fine, right there. And then we'll go like this. And put that here. Uh, do we want it facing like that, or do we want it like that? Let's go with that. That's fine. There we go. Now we've got Wi-Fi. A nice strong Wi-Fi signal from the CV. Okay. It's awesome that we can work on this thing in the base. I still got to get all the lights up so that uh, that artifact, when we log back in, that won't be in. <laughs> Stupid artifact. Spawn artifacts. So, oh yeah, I left all the weapons. I left all the, um, I left those ones on. I left those turrets on. Okay. Well, that's fine. We don't have to put those on. So yeah, it's almost ready to go. We just got to put the uh, turrets on, make ammo for it, fill it up, put the stuff in it that we want. Uh, so, I mean, oh, the, Okay, the game engine is... Now, this isn't GPU. I was looking I was looking on my machine, and this is literally... The game engine stops for a second and then continues on. <laughs> it makes no sense. And when it does it, it actually... Um, like, even my GPU never runs above about 30% max, uh, even at most intense times it's not really it i've seen it get upwards of 50 percent on some extreme games and stuff if, and when i turn the settings up uh, i can get over 50 percent but my memory rarely gets above 15 20 percent cpu rarely above 15 percent and both of those were sitting at about 10 percent and would just <laughs> not go above that just kind of drop off a little bit even when when the game lags so it was like it wasn't using any hardware resources for a split second it just kind of freezes does nothing and then continues on um, and it seems to just get worse over time until you actually turn the game off it's like some sort of memory leak almost but like I say it's not memory like a memory space because I never get above like 15% so, yeah, I mean, the game the game itself uses about 10% of my RAM. It uses about 6.5 gig, and that's about 10%. So, well, guys, I'm going to leave it off here. Uh, we are now almost ready to uh, take this thing out, and it's got some massive storage now. So this is actually going to come in pretty handy. 
Let's take a look here. We've got a whole bunch of cargo boxes that provide the 64 slot at 16K. And then we have a regular ammo controller, or a regular con con container controller at 200,000. We have one ammo at 64, the other ammo at, 50, at 56. Okay, I didn't know that one was smaller than the other. Not sure what happened there. Okay, that's weird. And then we've got a harvest controller that's 264,000 and a harvest controller that's 280,000. So between the three, uh, the, the two wood, or in wood and the regular controller, we have, you know, 700,000 storage units between those three and then the uh, ammo and the other cargo combined. So we're, get, we're getting close to a million storage units on our combat vessel at this point. So it'll be good for going and gathering up stuff at the snow planet. And that's what we're gonna be doing. We're gonna throw the, uh, the turrets on, then we're gonna go get our stuff off the snow planet and bring it back, um, including our, our HV. It sh we should be able to squeeze it in here with, just shrink it down. If I have to, I'll knock the frickin' door off. <laughs> if I have to, I'll take the frickin' door off the ZV to get it in. Okay, guys. Well, next episode, I'll have more of the base done. Um, and I have an idea to make a storage shed that is going to be uh, separately powered from this base so that it doesn't consume uh, um, energy units from this base so it'll have its own separate storage and i think i can do that actually i'm going to test this right now let's let's see we're, what we're going to do is we're going to turn this guy off i'm going to turn it off okay so now we still have connection to its wi-fi we still have connection to its wi-fi We still have connection to its Wi-Fi. Oh, and we just lost connection to something. What was that? What what did we lose connection to? What did we lose connection to? Let's see. Uh okay, so we did lose connection to the uh dart but would get it back at 100 no oh yeah all right so even you know what 100 meters with it turned off um yeah because this guy's a little closer 100 meters with this guy turned off and that's what i thought we can we don't have to we don't have to be right beside it if it's turned off as long as it's got Wi-Fi it's going to be 100 meters because we can get into it and access all the stuff absolutely yeah see we can so that might be the way to go because I don't know if I can do a second base close enough to make it um, to make it so that I can connect to its Wi-Fi while I'm inside this base. And that's really all I need to do is just connect to the Wi-Fi. So I'm thinking I'll make a little CV under this base, a little flat one that's just cargo. That's just freaking cargo, full of freaking cargo, just mass amounts of freaking cargo. And that way I don't have to worry about it. I'll put a Wi-Fi signal on it and who cares? <laughs> it's not going to consume any power. I'm not even going to put a freaking power on it. I'm not even going to put power on it. I don't think I'll need to. Uh, okay, guys. Well, that's my idea. I don't know if it's going to work. Well, I think I want to try it though. So until then, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.